It's time. I'm here with the man of the hour, Henzo. Henzo, how is everything going today? Is everything going to plan? Oh man, it's going crazy. I had I had the last last two days I had the total of three hours and a half sleeping. You got that much? I didn't think yeah. you'd get any. In two days, that was two days. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, it was a hard work, but it, it was worth it. Like what I saw here today was unbelievable. The fights, yeah. the people, the friends coming over to visit. You know, it's all the all the all the people supporting, all the companies supporting yeah. the event it was unbelievable. So tell me, you know, for some people out here who were dumb enough not to come, what are they missing out on right now? Oh, the, one of the best jiu-jitsu experiences ever, you know, like we had Carlos Conte sitting down on the bench with, uh, with all the crowd enjoying yeah. watching the fights and enjoying the event, you know, it's like uh, we had all the unbelievable people that belong to our sport here today and it was a unique experience to, to be uh, with all, everything to do with jiu-jitsu under one roof. Why did you want to create this kind of an event? It was a dream. Since I was young, I used to go to even dog expos, you know, and yeah. I say, how we don't have an expo? And uh, last year we were able to put everything together in two months, you know. And the beauty is that we have access to all the companies mm -hmm. that, that support our sport, that they sponsor our sport, and we were able to bring them in to a dream that we had. And we were able to be, do a very successful expo last year. And we did it again, you know. Like this year we doubled the size, we have two days competition, and we doubled the boots numbers, and everything is growing, you know. The attendance has been the double. So, you know, I'm happier than I was like last year, believe it. Like we're at the end of day one right now. Now, what is the most fulfilling part to you about this whole thing? It's to know that we had a great day, you know, and I, I was able to see the people that I love and that I grew up with, that I see them growing up, you know, like I was telling stories about uh, when I teach the first jiu-jitsu lesson to Lovato's father, and he's, he was fighting here today. Yeah. It's everything is a unique experience, you know, and memories is the, is the main thing that we're going to take to a grave when we die. Everything True. else will stay, you know, so it's... To me today was an unforgettable day because I was able to collect and fill it up my pockets and my heart with a lot of good memories. What do you think that this is contributing to the jiu-jitsu community? What is the feedback that you're getting right now about this event? It's a, it's a, it's a very positive one because we, we actually spreading the beautiful world and the beautiful lifestyle because jiu-jitsu is not just a sport or a fighting style. Jiu-jitsu is a lifestyle. It's like once you embrace jiu-jitsu, you become a jiu-jitsu man, your soul changes, you know. And, uh, and it's the opportunity to spread that, to spread the beautiful gift that I received when I was born, because I was born in the Gracie family. And I'm able to give this to everybody around, everybody who was born with the name Smith and the name Will, you know, yeah. and they all have the chance to. <laughs> Did you just say Will Smith? I didn't know he was doing jiu-jitsu. <laughs> I think one of the things that we found as uh, practitioners and fans is the collective vibe. People seem to be really happy. You can go to any different spot between the vendors, just what's out here. And not only Do you this, feel but that? The, yes, and not only that, but the, the celebrities of yeah. our sport, they are walking around here. Yeah. You can approach them, hug them, get a, a picture with them, yeah. you know, and, and, and ask them for anything. They will answer honestly yeah. how they think, and you, you have a chance to, to meet the people that you admire, you know, and, and your heroes yeah. on the sport, and you can change knowledge, exchange knowledge them, and some point of view and they'll be glad you know yeah. to see how you see it and how you think so before I let you go I gotta ask where do you see this going do you see it continuing and how do you see it developing to be honest I only see growing you know yeah. I know that next year we're gonna be bigger and next year we're gonna be more successful we're gonna be able to bring more people and and it's I think it's such an amazing sport and such an amazing way of living that it uh, there's nowhere to go but up and and and, and spread you know yeah. like as we sprint our horizons we're gonna grow and you know soon we're gonna have an expo every month awesome. in a different place god please make that happen <laughs> i can't tell you how happy we are as a community we want to thank you on behalf of everybody here it's thank you so pleasure. much for just your time. To let you guys know i just verbal tap him ah <laughs> i love it thank you so thank much you, man